The Polyline tool, found in the basic tool palette, creates open or closed objects made of a series of connected arcs, curves, or lines. The Polyline tool has multiple drawing modes found in the toolbar. These modes allow different segment types to be drawn. While creating a polyline, we can quickly switch between these modes using the U key or by clicking on the modes in the toolbar. A single polyline can have multiple different combinations of vertices. The first mode of the polyline tool is corner vertex mode. This mode creates segments with straight lines and angled vertices. The next mode is Bezier vertex mode. This creates segments with curves pulled towards, but not touching, the control points. Cubic vertex mode creates line segments that pass through the control points. Tangent arc mode creates segments that are tangent to the previous segment. For this mode, make sure that the Snap to Tangent option is turned on in your snapping palette. Point on Arc mode creates segments that are drawn using three clicks. This mode is most useful when tracing existing arcs. The first click is the start point. The second is a point the arc passes through. And the third is the end point. Arc Vertex Fillet mode creates segments with curves that look like a fillet placed at the control point. Before using this mode, we will want to enter the preferences and make sure the fillet radius is set to the desired value. If the desired polyline is an open object, simply double click on a point where you want the polyline to end. If the polyline should be closed, either click on the original starting point or simply use the K key shortcut to quickly close the final segment. The Polyline tool is useful when creating a shape with multiple straight and curved segments. Only one tool is needed instead of using multiple tools and the Compose command.